In this video, I will be helping you learn how to use Messenger on your laptop for beginners. Messenger is your gateway to seamless communication. You can stay connected with friends and family, express yourself with ease and never miss a moment with the famous Messenger application. To start using Messenger on your PC, first of all, you will need to download Messenger application. If you don't want to use the Messenger application, you can simply go ahead and launch open a web browser, type in messenger.com and use your Messenger account from a web browser. But if you'd want to start off by downloading the Messenger app, watch the video till the end. Step 1. Downloading Messenger application. Simply go ahead and open up a web browser on your PC. Go to the URL box and type in messenger.com slash download. Press enter on your keyboard to end up in this official web page. Click on the download for Windows link appearing on the left hand side menu. Now wait until the messenger is downloaded after the installation file has been downloaded. For Messenger, click on Open File. Wait for the setup to complete. Follow through the on-screen prompts in order to install Messenger on your laptop. Step 2. Log in or sign up for Messenger. Soon after you launch open the Messenger application once the installation is completed, you will now need to log in with your Facebook account or with your phone or email. If you already have a Facebook account, click on Login with Facebook. But if you don't have a Facebook account yet, you will need to create one. Click on Create a new account in order to start creating a new Facebook account. And once you've completed through the registration, log into your Facebook account by typing in your email address and password associated with it. After you are done with the credential, click Login. After entering your credentials correct, click on this Open Messenger for Windows button. Now, you will be able to Log into your Messenger account. Step 3. Explore Messenger Home. Upon logging in or signing up, you will land in the Messenger homepage. Here, you will be able to see the recent chats, active contacts, and more. Step 4. Starting a new conversation on Messenger. To begin a new conversation, click on the pencil icon at the top right hand corner. Now, select a contact in the pop-up that you'd like to begin a conversation with. After selecting the name or entering the name you'd like to chat with, you can now send messages by typing down a message in the text box at the bottom. While sending in your messages, you can add attachments by clicking on this plus button on the bottom left. Here, either record a voice clip or add attachments according to your need. Select the file you'd like to send from your computer and you will be able to send attachments with your message as well. You can also send stickers, emojis to your recipient on Messenger. After typing in your text, click on the little send message button on the right corner and there you will be able to send a message to one of your Messenger's contact. You can also initiate voice call or video call through Messenger. Select any contact you would like to initiate a voice or video call to and then click on the call button at the top right in order to initiate an audio call. Similarly to make a video call, click on the video icon at the top right corner. And for the final step, you can now personalize your messenger by clicking on your profile button at the bottom left and clicking on preferences. Now, here you can manage your general settings, notifications, privacy settings and much more. When you are finished using Messenger, ensure to log out by clicking on the log out button. In the pop-up, click on log out once again to confirm. And there you have it. You are now equipped to utilize the Messenger app on your laptop to connect with your loved ones seamlessly. That's the wrap up for today's video. If you found the video to be helpful, go ahead and give us a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel by hitting the subscribe button. Also press on the notification bell so that you'll never miss another upcoming upload from us. I will be back again in the next video. Thanks for watching.